The storage facility for the National Museum Archive in Swords, County Dublin, remained sealed off today for a forensic examination following this planned and targeted theft. At around 20 to 11 last night, three masked men forced their way in and tied up the security man on duty. They stole these four rhino heads, each with two horns, worth around a half a million euro. They loaded them into a white van driven away by a fourth man. The security man, who was uninjured, later freed himself and raised the alarm. These people appear to have known what they were looking for when they went in. They spent just over an hour on the premises and uh, having stolen the four rhino heads, uh, they loaded into what's only described as a white transit or high-ace type van. Um, I would say that these were quite large and it would have taken at least two people to carry each of them. The National Museum says the rhino heads and horns are of no medicinal value. Ironically, they were only moved from the Natural History Museum over a year ago to prevent them from being stolen for the multi-million euro international medicines black market. There's a very high value on this powdered material. It's the same material as your hair and your fingernails. So it's of no medicinal value whatsoever. It's been studied in great detail. People have written scientific papers to prove that point. But that doesn't seem to change the attitudes of people interested in traditional medicine. And of course, it's also a very high status thing. It's more than gold in value when you weigh it. Garthy say the gang that stole the rhino heads knew what they wanted, how much they were worth, and where to find them in this, a building the size of two football pitches.